Hi everybody, welcome to my craft room, or my craft table. <laughs> Excuse me, this is Miss Judy, and I have found something that I had to share with you. I'm loving looking at this new, close to my heart, um, Cricut art booking cartridge. Uh, I've been looking around on the internet to see, look at card ideas and things that are going on with different people, what they're making, and I noticed a lot of file folder cards, and I thought, mm, I think I've seen something like that in this cartridge, and absolutely have we got it in this cartridge. If you'll look on page 42 and 43, photo mat 1 on 42, Photo mat two, a uh, photo mat one on forty three. Both of those, the shift and the regular, make these really really cute file folder cards. I have um, made one card with it, but I've also made the samples, and I wanted to show those to you so that you can see what they look like. This one is. Photo mat one on page 42 and it looks like this and then you fold and you have your file folder that you can do and I cut it at 5.25 um, this one is the shift button I also cut it at 5.25 they're so easy. There's a notch that shows you where to fold, but I'm just going to do it with my finger for now. This is the uh, shift button, and you have this really cute little scallopy effect as opposed to just a plain but straightened out effect. Now, on photo mat one on page 43, you have this cute scalloped edge file folder that folds in like this. And then the shift button on page 43 has um, some scallop, not scallop, but just some design work on the side. And then you fold it up to a cute file, I would call it a file folder card but it's just a little decorative card that opens very conveniently on the side if you want to do it that way or if you want to do it up at the top you could do it a top fold so those four file fold cards are all in the art booking cartridge page 42 and 43 i cut them at 5.25 you can cut them whatever size you want but they fit perfectly into an A2 size card, uh, envelope, okay? So, I want to show you one that I dec or we're going to decorate one together. Okay, I pulled out some of the um, baby cakes, new paper that we have. I pulled out the um, file folder with the scallopy edges. I cut two of the cards because this baby cakes paper is two-sided it's the, this is the one I chose the little giraffes which I love and then it has the yellow little squares on the back so let me show you what we're going to do for the outside layer what I did was trim off this well no wait that's 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 not what I trimmed this one comes a plain side here so I'm going to put this layer on top of that flap. And I inked around with, um, I got wild and crazy when I went to um, Michael's the other day. They had ink on sale. And I got some gold ink a color block or color bo box. And I went around the edges of this one with that gold ink. The next layer, I took the flip, the back side of one of the flaps and just trimmed it off the way, the size I wanted. Because I wanted a little layer to go on top 
with the giraffe showing. And then I have two things that will go on that. So let's put this down. I went ahead and put a ribbon around it and a little bow. And then I went to page, um, I went to page 50, the, old, the baby mini album, and I cut out the giraffe and I sized him, I had um, 3.25. Uh, but I had to size him a little bit in the uh, craft room, which was fine. I just sized him to the size I wanted him to be, 3.5. And here's the little giraffe. I tied a little bow around his neck. And I put an eye on him. And he's going to be right here. And I put some foam tape on the back. And let's put him on. He's so cute. <laughs> and looks so cute on the giraffe paper. He's going to go right here. And then also on the front, I used one of the stamps that's in the stamp set that comes with the art booking collection. You get three sets of stamps with this collection. You get, this one is called Sweet and Lovely. This one is called Take Note, and this set is called My Life. All three of these stamp sets are in the bundle with the art booking cartridge. What I decided to use was the stamp on this uh, set that says Sweet. So I cut that out, or I inked it with some cocoa colored ink on a piece of the um, kind of a raspberry color and, and then I cut a not, another banner of, that's a little bit larger out of the brown that is the background of the giraffe and he's on one piece of foam tape so that's going right there sweet then for the inside I'm going to use the giraffe paper and I cut I'm just going to I cut that off and I'm just going to put it right on top of the card where it will be matching exactly that card back. So here goes this. Then the next part is the back side of the giraffe, the little yellow piece. I used another stamp from this set called the, that comes with it called the sweet and lovely and I use this little stamp here that you can like write a little cinnamon on or sign or maybe you might want to have an invitation type thing or an announcement James March 27th six pounds whatever but it's got lots of lines that you can write on and so I'm going to lay it right in the middle here and it's going to go flat so that if you wanted to write which I will be writing a message because this is going to go to a friend who is a new Grammy like me. And put that in the middle. And then I can write my little note to her. And I have my card. It's cute and different. And I like file folder cards. So don't forget, you can make file folder cards very unique from this cartridge and there are the four and you know what there might be more but I just haven't found them yet so I'm gonna keep looking and I find something new every day I'll have to be a commercial real quick close to my heart is celebrating National Stamping Month y'all and when you purchase $50 or more you can get three of the large stamp sets for only $10, it's called the um, Whimsical Trio. And when you log in, you, you make your order, if it's $50 or more, it's going to automatically pop up on your screen and give you a choice of buying that or not buying that. It will also give you a choice on the fall, um, September stamp of the month, 
which you can buy for five dollars so there's a lot of nice value this month with close to my heart uh, if anyone is interested in the catalog just let me know and I do want to thank all of my customers who have purchased the last couple of months from me lots of you guys have art booking so I want to see your projects okay that's it I am through for today's card thank you so much for watching my video I love talking to you and I love talking to myself Ta-ta!